Well, hi everybody, here we are at CES 2011. It's January 2011. Here we are in the Entropic booth with the Jethead DirecTV RView demonstrations. Uh, we have a couple of demonstrations here. The right hand side is the DirecTV uh, RView based home media server and client set top box configuration. We have one server with three clients running in a whole home DVR solution. As you see on the right, there's a lower screen with four, a four up display. That's the four set-top boxes, and one of them's on the main screen. On the left-hand side, we've got a Jethead uh, software demonstration, uh, multiple clients and multiple servers, showing multiple UIs, which I'll zoom in, in on in a second. So, here we are. The DirecTV server, and then one, two, three clients, all Mocha connected. There's the four displays, and I can uh, bring up a guide on one of the boxes. You see there, I can navigate the guide. And the user interface on all the boxes is identical. If we move over to the other side of the demonstrations, first of all, we've got three servers. We've got a Jethead RView server on a Marvel-based plug computer, uh, connected there with an uh, Ethernet to coax bridge. We also have a Linux laptop server, and we have a Technicolor Intel Groveland-based DVR platform, all running the Jethead RView server with a different UI. Uh, higher up on the display, we have a, a number of different RView client implementations uh, based on different silicon manufacturers' SOCs. We have one based on Broadcom, we have one based on the Marvell silicon, one based on ST silicon, and then a couple here based on the Sigma Designs silicon, um, which currently in this display is running the high def graphics. We also, this time, have a couple of tablet computers. Uh, this is the Samsung Galaxy um, Android tablet, and here we have the an Acer Android tablet. And as you see from the icon there, the tablets have an RView client on them, which uh, allows us to stream content to the Android tablet and display the user interface once the demo loads up. I'll, I'll come back to that. We've again got a four-up display here, showing uh, actually three of the, the three different user interfaces. On the uh, top left here, top right, I'm sorry, we have the, the Jethead user interface in standard definition from one of the servers. We have a Verizon uh, new user interface emulation on the left-hand side. And then on the bottom left here, we have the... Uh, a new Jethead demonstration to show some RView-based animation and, again, high-definition graphics. So, first of all, we'll look at this. This is uh, high-definition graphics and animation being t done with the RView protocol. Uh, here we've got 20 high-definition images being manipulated at the client side by the server. Uh, the server's giving the client commands and telling it how to manipulate the images into this very attractive 2, 2.5D two kind of uh, image sequence which uh, washes the images backwards and forwards and then zooms into a particular image full screen in high definition. And you see it's, uh, it's pretty smooth, nice crisp quality. Uh, this is just showing that there are capabilities uh, beyond what's typically been shown so far within the RView protocol environment. Uh, finally, up at the top here, we have uh, the high-definition Verizon user interface. And in this case, it's displayed uh, on an RView-enabled television, which is a uh, Zoran-based reference design TV. Uh, that is the Jethead RView demonstrations for CES 2011.